So in this video, I'll be opening over 50 treasure chests, not only on my account, but on some viewers' accounts too. I kind of like doing it last time, so we're going to do it a second time. I'm also doing a ton of giveaways on this game, so make sure you guys subscribe and join up the Discord in the description. Anyways, we're going to go check up how many treasure maps I have. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 treasure maps on my account. I think I pop, or not pop, I'm so used to Souls RNG, but I think I use 20 treasure chests on two people's accounts. So that will make it a total of over 50 just a little bit over 50 and one thing i've learned about using treasure chests or treasure maps is we have to appraise them all at once because what this does is it gives us the opportunity to find multiple treasure chests in one area we're going to be finding out the coordinates on every single one so be back with you guys once we are done with all these treasure maps all right i have fixed every single one of my maps okay i have a decent amount of fish i should probably sell one of my metas for this is obviously that we're gonna go to like area to area and just hope that we can find some treasure chests there usually i just look underground like this to check okay so we have a full view of everything here yep there's one right perfect come on give us sunken rod I've actually never opened treasure maps on my account. This is the first time and it took me a very long time to get these treasure maps. It took me since I made that video on all these people's accounts to get 12, only 12 treasure maps. So I'm really hoping that we we cook some pretty good stuff on Aurora Totem. Any Anything good, really. Even the Sunken Rod I'll be happy with. I'll complete my collection of every rod in the game if we do get the Sunken Rod. Will I make a video on the Sunken Rod? Probably not because it's not really too good. It's not a rod I would like use over i want to say the no life rod and even the rod of the depths they're both like better options so so honestly i'm fine with an oro totem you only want to give me an oro totem i'm okay with it just don't give me the bobbers you're giving me right now and we're good also since we're on topic and i'm yapping a bit how do you guys feel about anime adventures announcing that they're going to be back honestly i'm really hyped it used to be a game i played a lot and grinded a lot but it was a game i spent a lot of money on so gold coin bobber well at least it's a new bobber new discovery at least i know for a fact i'm going to be spending another bag on anime adventures not really too too hyped about that but still hyped about the game dropping hey there we go aurora totem that was early as well that's what we like to see right there now we just need the sunken rod give me the sunken rod three quality bay crates mid come on come on sunken three quality bay crates again oh thanks for the two night shrimps and two weird algae everything else i don't need all right any treasures here yes there is this will be the sunken rod i can feel it we will finally get the sunken rod but this time on the main account Really? Really? Three of the same bobber? Come on, man. I don't know how many I have left. Maybe like five. Not looking too good. Just give it to me now, and we're happy. Ooh, okay. A new bobber. It's okay. At least it's not a used or not used, but already gone bobber. At least it's a new one. Okay, there's one right here. Come on, come on. Truffle worms, mid. Okay, there's two over here. Come on. Sunken rod, sunken rod. Oh my god, we actually got Sunken Rod. What? Oh my god, I was not expecting to get Sunken Rod on my main account. Ooh, oh my god. But dude, I'm gonna be honest, I was not expecting to get it at all. I think I, I think I have one more treasure. Alright, well, since we have one more treasure map, we're just gonna be looking for it. We got an Aurora, and we got the new rod. Hold on, let's equip it. Oh my god. We actually got the new Sunken Rod. There's absolutely no way. Okay, here is the last one. My last treasure chest, but it doesn't matter because we actually got the Sunken Rod. Enchant Relic. Hey, I'll take that. Oh, I will take that. That's 11k right there. I will... Dude, I probably have a ton of Enchant Relics right now because I've been farming the depths a stupid amount. So we're going to switch the day to night in a bit and then we're going to be enchanting our Sunken Rod and we're going to get Hasty or Abyssal. Hasty would be much more preferred though. All right, let's make it night real quick. Here we go. Let's me use the elevator, mister. Gotta get down there. Oh, my alarm went off. I had an alarm at 10 a.m. So I could fix the sleep schedule for tomorrow's update. That's actually hilarious. All right. All right, here we go. The small enchant relics. I have 12 of them. Come on, Sucker Rod. I need you to give me the one and only Hasty. Realistically, Hasty is the only good one on this rod because the lair speed is really low compared to the depths in the no life rod. So we want Hasty. We want Hasty. Trash. Do it again, really? Yeah, I don't know what's going on, but it's just terrible enchants. It's fine though, we have a ton of enchants to go through. Swift, that's like the Walmart version of Hasty. We don't want this. We don't want this trash. This enchant for a third time? Dude, we're getting every single mutation enchant for some reason. Why are we getting all the mutation enchants? Why can we not get like an actual good one? Like, see, we get we get another mutation. I've gone Noir four times and I've gone Ghastly twice.
finally! Oh my god, that took a unhealthy amount of time for no reason so its stats are actually kind of good it has 30 percent lure speed it has 150 control or sorry 150 percent luck 0.15 control and 50 percent resilience honestly the resilience is good the control is good the luck is really good the lure speed is its only issue because you're kind of gonna have to have hasty on this and you're still gonna need a bait in order to instant catch while on the new rod the worm or the rod of the depths you have really high lure speed and you already have the control resilience there you just have five percent less resilience and you can catch a lot bigger fish so honestly the new rod is way better but this rod if you somehow get sunken rod before the new rod is definitely the third best it's better than trident in my opinion M maybe not better than trident actually but it's still up there let me know your thoughts on this rod let me know if you guys want me to make a showcase on it but we are about to use the other accounts now and honestly i make i recommend you guys watching all the way to the end because we actually do get another sunken rod i did pre-record these videos beforehand yesterday night i actually did i already went on these fans accounts and already used the treasure map so i know what we get so we do get another sunken rod so make sure you guys watch all the way till the end man i just joined this public server to use 20 treasure chests on this size account and tell me why in this public server there's an aurora borales going on yo what Wait, his friend's in the server and he has a mic. Should I go up to him and talk to him? Yeah. Hey, what's going on, man? How's your day going? I think he's here. Yeah, I was about to say, I think he was just at FK. Hey, dude. What's up, Doom? Do you know me? But you don't know who I am? I'm your friend. I'm Bread. It's me. Voice changer. Yo. I want to get a voice changer so quick. Okay. What if I tell you? I hacked his account. Nah, I'm just playing. I didn't hack his account. Uh, I'm just here to use all 20 of his treasure chests. And get him the sunken rod. That's what I'm here to do. Wait, look what he said in the chat. Some guy's on my friend's account. I think he hacked. <laughs> no, no. Just using his maps for him. Why bro get so many maps though? Like, I'm jealous. Okay, done fixing all the 20 maps. Now, one thing I did learn about doing this from last time. Why is he, why is he private typing me? You better not take his fish or I will make sure negative stuff happens. Dude, I, I could care less about his fish, man. I'm here to get him sunken rod. Relax, dude. All right, so we're gonna go to like the most obvious spots for treasure chests. And last time what I did was I just put my camera down like this and maybe able to see like a ton of treasure chests. Found one right here, the obvious spot. Rich treasure map. Aurora Totem, hey, okay. Let's lock that for him. That's, that's a really good first treasure chest right there. I like that. Yeah, there is a treasure chest right here. I remember there being one right here. Oh, no, I think that's the one I caught. Yeah, it was. Six truffle worms, mid. Here we go, there's one right here. I think there's some underground here as well. I remember there being one underground here. But we'll look after this. Billionaire, hold on. We'll do that at the end. We'll become rich at the end, don't worry. Yeah, there's one right there. Six truffle worms, pretty mid. And... Tempest totem, pretty mid. Imagine we get two death rod. That would be a, or second rod. Sorry, not death rod. That'd be pretty crazy. That was his first gold coin. All right, come on. I don't know how many treasure chests it's been. Another fillionaire, pretty bad. I'd rather have some truffle worms to be honest than a fillionaire. Second rod. Tempest totem mid should have gave us an, an aurora and billionaire again. Come on, man. You know that's not what we need. To be honest, even if we don't get anything good, it's still pretty good what we got. I mean, we did get the one and only Aurora Totem. That's still 500k right there. And gold coin again. Here comes the mass bobbers. We get the compass. That is a new bobber for him. Even though uh, I kind of I kind of predicted that we were going to get the bobbers. Three quality bait crates. That's pretty mid. And uh, we even get we got some pretty good stuff out of that, honestly. And I've gone an Aurora already, Totem. Damn. Yeah, Aurora Totem. Pretty good. Oh, another Aurora Totem. Hey, two. You know what? That's Wait, probably that's better than getting. that's for the Borealis, right? Yeah. Yo. You know, that might be better than getting the rod itself, because the rod is pretty Honestly, out, yeah. Out right <laughs> All right, come on. Suck it, Rod. Compass. Here comes the bobbers. What the hell does a compass do? It's a bobber. And... Suck it, Rod. 
Truffle worms, not bad. They buff the amount of bait you get every time you pull bait out of the chest. And honestly, it's not even bad. It's better than getting compasses, I can't lie. Oh, well, there's another one right here. Perfect. Two and one. Weird algae. Mm. Three! Compass again. Second to last. Sunken rod. Nope. Weird algae. It's better than a compass, though. Last one. Can we get sunken rod? We unlocked the Whoa. Whaley Bobber. At least we got- That's what I got when I did. At least we got two Aurora Totems. Better than having nothing. And it's better than having, honestly, the second rod, because it's pretty min now. All right, so today we have a other account. Wait, my, why is my game frozen? Okay, there we go. This guy has, I think, 20 treasure maps. So we are going to try and get him the sunken rod. And I think, I'm 90% sure, he's already... Yeah, he has. Okay, he's already decoded every single one, so we don't have to worry about going to Forsaken Shores. Every time I hover over to my second monitor, it's weird because it'll just, like, freeze my map or my game. I don't know what's going on with Roblox, but ever since I restarted my PC everything's been tweaking out all right let's go find the first map i think i see the map it is down here okay first map of the day i heard they buffed it so we got a billionaire you know what it's not horrible billionaire all right who we make any money a thousand a thousand that's it i was kind of whack i was kind of expecting more money right there oh why are we stuck on the screen there we go Next map. I think I see two treasure maps here. I do. Okay, I see two treasure chests here. That's that's a bit weird. I forgot that we could technically look for more than one. All right, come on. Bless us with something good. A compass. Okay, really? Okay, what about this one? Three quality bait crate. I mean, honestly, that's not even bad. It's not good, but it's not horrible. You know, some, some decent bait in there. I'm gonna open them just because. One, two, three. Hey, yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't horrible. Okay, well... Here's another one. So for something good. Six weird algae. Did they buff it? It used to be like three or four. Unless I'm just tripping. Okay, I do see one. Okay, let's not get in that whirlpool. But I do see a chest right here. I just randomly saw it through from pretty far. Got a compass again. I thought they made it so you can't get two of the same bobbers anymore. Uh, unless I, I read wrong. But we found three treasure chests before the one I'm currently looking for. Treasure chest, sorry. Another compass? Dude, that's like three in a row. That never happens. Is This is even the one we're looking for. A gold coin. That's another bobber. We've gone three bobbers in a row. I think this is the one we were looking for right here. Yeah, this is the one we were looking for. We got we got the second rod. Oh my god. No way. Wow. Hold on. I gotta equip it. it didn't even take us ever, like all of our enchants. Or sorry, not enchants, treasure maps. Look at that. Look at this one go, eh? Shake a bit, you know. There we go. It has a pretty good bar. So it has what 15% resilience and a bar this big. That's really good. Reminds me of the no life rod. Yeah, 50% resilience, 150% luck. You put rapid capture on this this bad boy, and it's basically game over. Alright, well, we still have a ton of treasure maps to go look for. has 287 relics my goodness okay we are definitely gonna get hasty or abyssal so hopefully quick so we can end the video pretty quick i'm pretty tired i'm not gonna lie with y'all i don't know if you guys can hear my voice but yeah I, I am pretty tired sea king trash 
Just give it a, give it to us early, man. Let's not waste this guy's relics. There we go. There's Hasty. Okay, we're gonna keep Hasty, and the reason why we're gonna keep Hasty is because of its terrible lure speed. So now we just need like a decent bait, and we should be quick enough. I feel like the flakes would be good enough. Honestly, I think we've already been past the tenth roll. Uh, I don't think anything really happened. No effects, no nothing. So I think we're just gonna call it. We're gonna do one more, and I think we're just gonna call it right there. Yeah, I don't think there was no effect. I think it's just a passive. Well, that's that's it for this guy's account. I, I feel like, you know, he told me he's not really going to use it. But uh, it's nice to see that he got something new on his account. A new rod. And it's actually a pretty good rod at it. So I'm happy for this guy, man.